It's not a maintain flight level 300, so I to do 7. Whoa, whoa. Uh, what is that? The elevator feels really stiff, sir. All right, don't force. This is South Jet 227. We're in an uncontrolled dive descending out of 21,000 feet. We're declaring an emergency. We've dumped our fuel. We got a jam stabilizer or something. We need a block of altitude to work the problem and a heading to the nearest airport. South Jet. Hey everybody, how is everybody doing? Uh, it is Friday, I think. Yeah, still Friday. And uh, Bitcoin is indeed still going down and it's going down hard. Currently 41,765, I believe, and falling, not doing too well currently. But I did place some trades uh, recently on Bybit using uh, Metaverse tokens that were available on Bybit. And those token, uh, those orders rather, are here. I'm just going to go to them uh, now. Uh, derivatives. Let's have a look at my trades. See how they're doing. Wait for it to load. There we go. So, right now, Mana USDT is doing quite well, up 24%. Sand USDT, which is uh, the, the one that I've neglected to talk about properly in uh, my second video of the year. You can go back and watch that. Link is above me right now. Uh, go and watch that and check it out. It's the one I failed to mention. It's the one that I completely forgot. I will be doing a video on that soon. Uh, it's the same one that Snoop Dogg has land in. Uh, so I, I don't know what that entails, but I guess you'll be able to play the game with, with Snoop Dogg, I assume. Uh, Axie Infinity isn't doing too great right now. Minus 12%. Uh, at the moment, uh, engine is minus one, so meh, not too bad. Uh, and then Smooth Love Potion, which is, of course, the uh, token that's tied to Axie Infinity for the game, is down 32% right now. So, what the hell, man? That's doing really bad. That sucks. But, you know, I hold out hope. You know, maybe it'll go up eventually. Maybe it's tied to Bitcoin. I didn't think of that. Yeah, it's a possibility. It's possibly tanking because Bitcoin is tanking. But Mana and Sand are starting to do very well. Well, Mana's doing well. Sand just went out of the money there, so I'll stop talking about it for now. They're, they're going to fluctuate in and out of the money. But Mana is doing really, 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 really well. And the main reason I wanted to do this video today is to do an update on VMates. I know I keep doing a lot of talking on VMates right now, but there is a lot of exciting stuff happen. So if you don't know, go back and watch the first video of the year. Uh, I was talking about how we entered into the IDO and uh, I staked some uh, tokens. In fact, we're going to go ahead and look at uh, how that's doing right now. Uh, so we head over to the... Uh, I need to connect my wallet... I need to change the network from the main to the smart. There we go. Boom. Connect wallet again. Come on. Wake up. There we go. So, uh, last video I had 12.6. I now have 12.7. So, I'm doing 0.1 uh, mate tokens every 24 hours on average right now. Uh, on the 23rd of January, I will unlock another 25% and, of course, stake those. I am also tempted to start buying some more mate as well. I may do a, uh, another video of me buying some of that and staking some more of it later. Uh, but for now, I'm really excited to talk about some of the stuff that's been happening with uh, VMates. They've been releasing some uh, wonderful little tidbits on the game and uh, talking about that. So the first thing I want to talk about is uh, they have announced today, if I can find the tweet, that they have partnered with MetaRun. And MetaRun are about to start their IDO next week, I believe. Uh, if you go over to their Twitter, which is at MetaRunGame, uh, you can see their IDO um, uh, schedule uh, that they've posted on there today. And uh, I asked about that, and the answer I was given was MetaRunner working on their IDO happening next week. Uh, so we're cooperating 
uh, right now. But definitely after our game launch, we will share our common resources such as the user base and we can add each other's game features and leave one building on the plaza as their game entrance. So interesting, when VMates launch their game, they will have a plaza, uh, essentially, and uh, Meta Run will have a location within that plaza that you can then go into the Meta Run game, which is very interesting, a very interesting collab indeed. So that is... Super cool. We'll be checking that out. The other thing that they were talking about today is uh, different features and aspects of the game itself. And they were choo uh, saying, after choosing your favorite favorite pets, do you know how to check their status? There will be two attributes at initial, uh, which is the pet's HP and cleanliness. You should carefully keep these two in high level so that your pet could work and earn rewards. Interesting. Uh, the next update that they uh, posted was uh, this screenshot here which is from inside the game uh, which shows two pets one being a panda and the other one being uh, I don't know a type of doge I guess uh, battling it out and it says in the arena we will present a unique pet fighting system that creates a more fair competition environment we are focusing on P2E uh, which is play to earn instead of pay to win each pet has four attributes which are HP attack defense and agility these attributes will increase the pet uh, as, as the pet levels up so that then ties in if you go to the vmates uh, website you can see that they have limited edition panda nft collectible art and if you go over to uh, OpenSea right now and search uh, vmates uh, you will then see the VMates NFTs right here, which is all the pandas. Uh, they're all pretty much on 0 0.1 wrapped ETH at the moment. Uh, this one's up for five, uh, but it was obviously bought uh, and so on. This one's up for 99 ETH now. So, yeah, some of them are getting bought up and, you know, traded for, you know, ridiculous uh, prices. The uh, There's no collection results. I don't know if there's a floor price. I probably... Probably not in the right area or something, but there's a thousand of these. And if you go to the website, it says, "Come and be, uh, come and become Panda's friend." Vmates now offering the special events to pre-sale uh, the limited edition Panda Pet. There are a total of a thousand pandas uh, that are waiting for their partners. Each of them has the unique NFT collectible art and being listed on the OpenSea.io. Uh, all of the pandas' collectible arts can be redeemed for the limited edition Vmates virtual panda pets and gain early access to the Vmates game. Vmates will officially launch the pet gaming function in quarter four, 2021. Buy now on OpenSea. And they also have this, a premium pet egg. Current price, nobody knows. And nobody knows what they'll hatch into. Will they be some sort of special... Uh, pet that you can use in the game, no doubt. Hopefully, and it doesn't end up being a fishing rod. So, looking at the uh, pet supplies here, you can get cleaning supplies. So, I, I guess it's kind of, you know, in, in a way, it's going to be a little bit like Tamagotchi. Uh, in the sense that you have to look after your pet, wash it, feed it, all that kind of stuff. And you can dress it up as well, make it look cute. Uh, and then you can get toys for it as well. So, the thing that you're playing with has something to play with. That is meta. Um, so, you know, essentially you can do all of these things in there. So it's basically going to be uh, like a Tamagotchi game that you can make money from. Uh, yeah. I mean, why not? Looks pretty cool to me. And if I can make thousands off of a panda, I will be quite happy. Uh, so that is something to look at and when the game is released I will be covering it and going into the game for the first time and providing the very first look at the game when it is released uh, so there's that to look forward to as well I am really looking forward to trying it out and I think I am going to grab myself a panda whilst they are cheap and available uh, so I will be doing that and um, so yeah with uh, Meta Run uh, collaborating with VMates now and uh, talking and showing screenshots from the game itself, I think it's fairly safe to say that you can see a product coming to fruition with this. So if you hold VMates tokens and you haven't dumped them right now, you know, good for you. If you dumped them, better luck next time because this looks like a project that really is going to take off. So if you sold your mate tokens, it is cheap right now. Head over and buy some more. I certainly will be. And then you can stake those as well. And as you can see, I am uh, earning mates every single day. So make it work for you. Gain as many as you can. Get yourself some NFTs along with it and uh, join in. And then when the game is released, uh, I believe we'll be seeing a first look at that towards the end of this month uh, before the next unlock comes along. So, yeah, 
some pretty cool stuff. This is one project that I can see going very, very far. The last thing that I wanted to show you all is uh, a little screen that I was given uh, to show uh, everybody, and it is the VMates Bank. The numbers on this preview right now are not real. This is just to showcase what it's going to look like. Um, so you're looking at token pools, uh, and staking uh, pools and things like that that you can take part in on VMate's very own bank. So another reason to be holding VMate token. Uh, so, you know, a lot of exciting stuff coming out from this project. We've got big partnerships, uh, a big game coming out, a big metaverse game coming out, huge NFT collection, which could end up going through the roof. And of course, the staking cryptocurrencies to earn mate bank. Uh, as well. So loads of really, really, really cool things coming out of the woodwork right now. Um, so that's basically it. I don't really have a lot more to talk about right now. Loads of exciting stuff with VMates. This is literally just a VMates update. I will be doing videos on other stuff that is out there at the moment. There's quite a lot of crypto games and NFT games out there that need far more exposure and far more to look at but I just wanted to do the update today on vmates so that you can see what's going on with that I'm really excited about this project so if that's worth anything to you head in jump in and get a part of it now uh, before it ends up being taken up by the masses later so thanks very much for watching guys I will be back in the morning uh, with another video and I will catch you then please like and subscribe share the video leave a comment as well uh, quite a lot of people told me what they want me to look at next what games they want me to look at next and things like that uh, make sure you do the same today take a look at the uh, the comments see what everybody else is saying and let me know what you want me to check out next um, because I can't just do vmates every day all day because that would get boring for me and everybody else so i need something else to look at where i can go in and i can actually play something that'd be absolutely awesome um uh, but yeah that's it thanks for watching guys take care and catch you tomorrow bye <laughs>